Hi guys, welcome to my balcony. And today I'm about to record video for you with the monthly report. This is our new idea. We're gonna do it on a monthly basis with everything that was happening in city real estate news in Miami. So let's go. First, Real Deal Real Estate South Florida Conference. Biggest real estate conference in the United States. A couple of things that I can tell you that I learned from that conference. One, what it means in a bubble. Market in Miami is way different from anywhere in the United States right now. So we're in a bubble in a good way. The second, AI. But AI will be in the real estate and everywhere in our lives. By the way, we already started using AI for our clients and for our marketing. Cipriani Bellini Wednesday is one of the events that Cipriani does for brokers, top brokers, as well as their clientele. And what I learned there, they're about to break ground. By the way, it's going to be soon, in December, waiting, 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 waiting for it. Waldorf Astoria, Pampana Beach. They just launched sales and they had a grand opening of their sales office. Waldorf Astoria and Pampana Beach is the second Waldorf residences in the whole South Florida and first only residence in the world. Pampano Beach lately for the last couple of years becoming booming area. There is more projects about to start sales. Rich Carlton Pampano Beach is almost sold out. Waldorf Astoria, one of the newest addition, right? Rosewood Residences. It's one of the biggest names as well in the hospitality industry in the United States. And couple more projects with even bigger names coming to Pampano Beach. And hopefully even more projects will be announced anytime soon. I can say to anyone who considered to buy real estate or move to Pampano, it's one of the up and coming areas. Keep an eye on it. If you have any questions about the area, please reach out to me. I'll be happy to guide you. Jeff Bezos, this is a big one, guys. Jeff Bezos is moving to Miami. After 29 years in Seattle, he's moving to Miami, back to Miami since he's originally from here. He was here in Miami High School as well, Palmetto. Same school as my friend Stefan Burke from Cipriani Residence went to Palmetto Bay. And also he's looking for office for the Amazon in Miami. I think that's pretty big news for Miami guys. Paragon Miami Beach just opened their sales gallery. It's like it in Miami Beach in one hotel. If you want to do presentation guys, don't hesitate to contact me. Paragon located in uh, Paragon will be built on 5333 Collins Avenue and it will have Michelin star restaurant and of course one of a kind amenities. It will be built by Starwood Group and Mast Capital. One of the latest news that happened in Miami is the top of four five park project that located in Miami Beach is going to be finished within a year by the end of 2024. Five Park is developed by Terra Group and it's gonna have gorgeous views on the east side of the ocean, Miami Beach, South Beach, and on the west side you're gonna have sunset views and the bay and downtown and i think you might see some edgewater and the brickle as well in general guys i can tell you november feedback about the market in miami it's picking up from what i hear from my colleagues right because fortunately for my team and for me as well for us september october and summer was it was not that slow but usually in miami season starts when it's getting colder everywhere, right? And everybody's moving to Miami and, and people starting shopping for real estate here in Miami. Overall market condition looks very promising. Season is coming, Miami, we're in December now, beginning of December, and Miami is always getting busier and busier. Now is the first week, our Basel, everybody's in town. And people start shopping for real estate. And I can tell you one thing, rates right now is about 7%, and it did not affect real estate Miami that much as everyone was hoping so. So can you imagine what's gonna happen when the rates will go down? And from my knowledge and from the news, next year they're planning to drop rates at least four times a year. So looks like the prices will increase even more. And if you guys didn't buy property for yourself and you're thinking to buy it with a mortgage, so don't wait too long. You know, everybody's already adjusted to those rates and the market in Miami, as I said, it's a different animal from whole United States right now. And prices 
in Miami most likely will be even higher. Unfortunately for some of the people, but fortunately for others. Still, we have that trend where a lot of wealthy buyers come into Miami, athletes, entrepreneurs, CEOs, they continue coming to Miami and buy trophy properties, waterfront houses, penthouses, and oceanfront residences. We see uptick in buyers coming in the beginning of December. Since December started for the last two days, we already signed three units at one of the projects. I cannot uh, mention a name as of now and totaling almost $20 million, as well as we have two buyers in town right now discussing another two units. So we see really, really good trend of buyers already in town. Guys, that was my first monthly report about Real Estate Miami and about everything that were happening in my business life, right? And if you have any feedback, please don't be shy, put in the comments. If you have any questions about real estate in Miami, you can contact me and just to remind you, my team covers markets from Coconut Grove to Fort Lauderdale. We work with the new developments, resales, with the condos, waterfront houses, non-waterfront houses. If you have any questions, we'll be happy to guide you with any real estate advice or purchase, or if you're looking to sell your property. And guys, of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel about Miami. And if you have any advices, what else you'd like to see on my channel, what else you'd like to see in my videos, I'll be happy if you can share it with me, since your feedback is very, very important for me. Guys, and don't forget to watch my YouTube videos that we uploaded this month. Four new videos, Baccarat Residences, Fisher Island. Uh, I did it first time and I haven't seen anyone doing videos on a Fisher Island. So thank you, Nirka from the Six Fisher Island. It's one of the newest residences on the island. As well, we uploaded property tour from New York with a good friend of mine, Alex, and our fourth video with a good friend of mine and the director of sales at the Paragon Miami Beach, Philip Friedman. Guys, if you'd like to stay updated with all real estate trends in Miami market, as well with every new development projects, subscribe to our newsletter. We have weekly emails with every detail on what's happening in Miami.